All of us who are gardeners when we were younger may have gardened with our grandmothers who always told us to put rocks or clay pot shards in the bottom of the pot to improve drainage. But research has actually shown that if you have a, a shallow container or a shallow soil profile, you actually get less drainage. We have three different types of pots. The bulb pot, the azalea pot, and then the standard pot. These three sponges are all filled with water to the same amount. If we leave this one shallow, like this narrower pot, um, it'll hold all of the water in it. But if I tip this sponge on its side to mimic the profile of the azalea pot, you begin to get drainage because the capillaries are longer and gravitational pull will actually be greater on it, so it will drain more water out by having a longer soil profile. And if we tip the sponge on its side, the long way to mimic the standard pot, which has a longer soil profile, there's more gravitational pull on that water in this sponge, and again, you will begin to see more water drain out of this soil profile. So if we leave gravel out of the pots, we actually have a longer soil profile, which allows gravitational pull to work on the water in the soil, and you actually get better drainage by filling the pot entirely with soil rather than having something in the bottom of the pot. This is Donna Hoffman for the University of Wyoming Extension, and you're watching From the Ground Up.